I looked up something, how to get the soap scum off these clear doors. A very lovely American lady said something about use the Dawn. I'm like, what is Dawn? It is an American dishwashing detergent, but this is the one I'm going to be using because I need to get rid of the lemon one. If you use this stuff on houses, don't use one that has like a flavor. So we bought this one by accident. So I'm going to use this one on this because if anything, we want this to rip stuff off. I brought to me squeegee. This is the non-scratch. This is the scratch one. Two microfiber cloths, another style of squeegee. In the video on YouTube, the lovely lady who said use the dawn uh, she just used her hand scrubbed you know with the old elbow grease I brought this I don't want to do that one cup of fake dawn what about that color and one cup of white vinegar imagine if it's exploded like I didn't watch the video right shower doors would be clean then where did me nozzle go I'd say I can't think at this hour but I can't think at any hour. All the hours are mushed together into my existence of life. So I said to get a sponge and like mix it. So what do you reckon of this method? I can see why you need to mix it with a sponge. It's stuck at the bottom. And she said, put on a lot. Oh, I think I'm supposed to be wearing gloves. Does vinegar hurt your hands? I mean, nobody wears gloves when they're eating fish and chips. And then she said, after you do this, you just leave it on for 15 minutes. So I'll probably forget and leave it on. 30. Oh, that is some strong stuff. Yeah, my hands are burning. I didn't use this. Oh, let's use it now. Yeah. I like the sounds of this. Imagine if all this scratched. I'd be like, this is a good method on how to do it. And then it's like, oh no. And that'd be typical. <clears throat> oh no. Oh no. Yep, I can see you've scratched the entire thing. <sighs> you should never work too late at night. I'm sorry. That was dumb. I'm curious because now, like, the soap scum is sort of a secondary issue. So I might not wait the 15 minutes. I might just hose this down and see how bad it is. Okay, so if you ever make a mistake as someone else's house and it actually needs replacing, that's coming in your paycheck. And then I would know how to install these things because I'd probably look it up see if they'd let me do it. Always try to work on a house when no one's home. So if you do mess up, you can like panic without them seeing you panic. Let's see what I've done. No, I actually don't think I scratched it. I didn't do it. No, there's no scratches. I didn't ruin it. I didn't break something worth hundreds of dollars. Yes, that was a close encounter. Wow, this is actually looking really good. This is a very, very good technique. So this is the angle the real estate agent's going to come in on. She's not going to get in the shower, which is nuts. This is looking fantastic. This actually worked. It looks great. Thanks, lady with the dawn. Whoops. Oh, great, now it's in the bucket. There's toilet stuff on the wall. Learned this on Instagram. I am going to try this idea. 